The summer has definitely arrived, which means we are officially in music festival season. But why do we love them so much? Why are they so iconic? We inhabit a culture that loves collective experiences, that feeling of saying, I was there, I experienced it. And a professor of clinical music and global health at New York University put it like this. Music festivals become a part of the culture, not just another event. To attend one is to become part of a major cultural moment. And the experiential economy is no small industry, with studies showing that we actually value experiences over material possessions. And this week, the pinnacle of all music festivals is underway, Glastonbury, where thousands of people will throw their hands up in the air in an act of worship of artists or songs, or simply the euphoria and escapism that comes with a collective experience of live music. So in a society moving away from traditional forms of faith, we still seek to be connected both to each other and something bigger than ourselves. No matter your belief to be human is to gather in a collective experience of worship. But the key question is, what is it that you're gathering around and what is it that you are worshipping? The picture of worship found in the book of Revelation is one of God on his throne and everything else pointing towards him. True Christian worship decenters ourselves. It's so much more than a temporary euphoric moment experienced at a music festival, but it is our response to being loved first by our creator. So this summer, if you're attending festivals, community events, or moments of collective experience, take a moment to consider what it is that you're gathering around and what it is you might be worshiping. <laughs>